Decorating with dark colors can be intimidating, but it doesn't have to be. Today we're going to talk about the how, what, where, and why of decorating with deeper tones to create minimal spaces that are cozy, intimate, and maybe even a little dramatic. Hi everyone, Liz here. Welcome to Balance and Rhythm. Autumn brings longer nights, so it's the perfect time to get moody and unravel the mystery of working with deeper shades. So let's take a look at how to incorporate darker color schemes into our spaces. Light and bright has been the trend, so why might we want to go dark? One reason is that darker colors add visual weight and depth to a space, creating an intimate atmosphere. They're moody, romantic, and sometimes dramatic, but they can also be calming and restful. Another is that we usually associate light colors and brightness with spaciousness, but dark colors can also help a room seem larger by blurring the edges of the space. Dark colors recede, so walls and ceilings painted in darker shades will seem further away. This has the added benefit of allowing lighter objects to move to the foreground. Set against this darker background, you can enhance the look of lighter pieces and materials like woods and metals. Some of the best spaces to use dark colors in are those you would think would benefit more from lighter colors, like those that get little to no natural light. It seems counterintuitive, but very small rooms or rooms that are windowless or with small or awkwardly placed windows might be the perfect space for a darker scheme. Because no matter how light and bright you try to make the room look, it will probably still feel drab because there isn't enough light to reflect off those light colors. Powder rooms are a great place to start experimenting with deeper shades. These rooms are small and very often windowless and present a perfect opportunity to create some drama. Since these are spaces we don't spend much time in, you can inject some excitement without being overwhelmed by it. Bedrooms are another great space to consider for a deeper scheme. If you tend to be in your bedroom only at night, this might be a perfect space to create a moody and intimate atmosphere. Darker colors simulate night, making the room restful and dark walls and ceilings won't reflect light that might disturb your sleep. If you have an ensuite, you can tie it in by extending the mood into the master bath. Dining rooms, especially when you entertain, are spaces where you want to create an experience. Bringing in deeper, richer tones helps create an intimate mood for relaxed dining and conversation. Specialty rooms like media rooms are also great spaces for dark colors so that the walls will absorb any light that might come in to brighten the room. You can use dark colors anywhere you like if you like that moody look, but think about how much natural light the space gets. You'll have more flexibility in the space if it gets plenty of natural light so you don't feel like you're living in a cave. The goal would be to have filtered daylight and warm artificial lighting on dimmers in the evening to get that cozy and intimate atmosphere. Add plenty of floor and table lamps to add to the warm ambiance and think about using reflective materials for some sparkle. There are lots of options when going to a darker scheme. Any paint with a light reflectance value below 50 will absorb light rather than reflect it, so that gives you a lot of leeway in selecting your colors. For the deepest colors, you can go with anything from black to charcoal to deep blue, or select medium to deep tones of neutral hues, mossy greens, or earthy reds. Look for warmer variations for a more natural look and mix in cool tones for balance. Some great coordinating hues to balance out the darkness are blush, lavender, and periwinkle, along with neutrals like ivory and cream. So what surfaces should you focus on? That depends on the feel you want for the space. If you're not ready to go all in with darker walls and ceilings, you can incorporate some deeper tones with built-ins, accent walls, or dark furniture. Or you could keep the walls and ceilings light and create the darker mood by bringing in darker accessories to create the feel. But if you're ready to take the plunge, painting walls and ceilings the same deep hue will create a cozy and intimate room envelope. This works well with lighter flooring, but you can also use this strategy with dark floors by selecting a lighter but still medium to deep tone for walls and ceiling. Be sure to incorporate reflective materials like metal, varied textures and natural finishes like leather and wood for contrast and visual interest. 
For more color inspiration, check out these videos. And if you like this one, please give it a thumbs up and please consider subscribing to be the first to know about new videos. Also, leave me a comment and let me know what you think about decorating with dark colors and what questions you have. Thanks so much for watching. I'll see you next time.